I'm doing some alterations for. Are you doing I have yeah. not stopped selling okay. since I started in, in 2020. Rebecca Kaysen's world was shaken up in 2020 when her former boss at her bookkeeping job encouraged her to start a small business. It happened on a whim, to be honest. Uh, our CPA said, hey, you need to start a business. And I'm like, doing what? I have no idea what to do other than bookkeeping. And he's like, well, what are you doing right now? And I said, well, I'm tearing up my clothes and sewing right now. And he's like, okay, you're a seamstress. And almost seamlessly, so Padre Alterations was born. It's Kaysen, who only sewed as a hobby, every did not take any fancy sewing classes or training. In fact, she had only done it for a couple of months after being self-taught. I, I like to cut, cut up my own clothes and, you know, zip it through a sewing machine and then um, and then there's DIYs, there's YouTube videos. I, I joined a lot of sewing uh, and crafts type groups on Facebook. In the beginning, Kaysen wasn't even getting paid, just working for tips. Not only does she alter clothes, but she also makes repairs to some other things. Boat. Uh, reupholstering, cushions, re makeovers for patio cu uh, cushions outside, wedding dresses, formal wear, military, patches, leather, you name it. If it fits under my sewing machine, I'm going to work on it. Kaysen is so grateful for the success of So Padre Alterations, but credits it all to her community. It's awesome because everybody here on the island, they like to support small businesses, and that's important. I didn't realize how important it was before. The community has helped So Padre grow tremendously over the past three years. It's just really grown. I mean, word of mouth, um, the community, Facebook, social media, nextdoor.com. Kaysen is as busy as an elf this holiday season with alterations and orders, and she is excited for her business to keep growing. To place an order with Rebecca, just search up So Padre Alterations on Google and give her a call or a text for a quote. On Padre Island, Erin Holly, Chris 6 News.